veteran in so many of these, these big time races and whatnot. What does this one mean? Uh, this uh, it was a tough one to make. You know, uh, a lot of people say uh, the U.S. is tough to, team to make, but they usually don't know why. But like this year, uh, my season did start really well. But I ran a couple of 830s, but uh, today I was like, I need either to get the standard or run a sub-820, which is, you know, there was a lot of guys who had faster time than me. Like, uh, <laughs> this, guy, oh, come on. this guy went to Europe, he ran my teammate Anthony, which he, I feel so bad for him, he fell today. Uh, but Rooks is an amazing kid, just one is here and, um, you know, yeah, it was really tough to make today. But, you know, it's, it's US team, so. Awesome. Yeah, no, um, like Peter said, you know, it's a hard, uh, hard team to make despite having some of the top guys not be in it this year um traditionally like it, it i mean probably six or seven guys is on you know uh toss a sheet over them as they say um coming into the bell lap and even the last 200 um so yeah i just tried to be patient and execute uh late in the race and, and trust my foundation and my uh past races and uh it's fun to finally make a team with a um fellow uh nai guy that's right so, man. yeah 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 I mean, how, how special is that? Like that, I mean, it, it, you know, it's it's one thing for one, it's another thing for two in the yeah. same race in the same year. Huh. I, actually, you know, I was thinking yesterday, this is what media never tells anybody. Like, uh, Abdeg and I, we went to NAI. He was an NAI champion, I was an NAI champion. But when we came here, nobody get to say, this guy soon never went to D1 from, from the start. You know, we're making the team together, like the NAI kids. How powerful is that? Yeah, no, I mean, uh, funny enough, I got tagged in a, an old, uh, uh, it was Wesleyan, Indiana, Wesleyan University, a Nationals photo of me, and, and he was right off my shoulder. Um, that was probably right before he passed me. Uh, but uh, you know, that must have been 2012 or 2013, yeah, 20, 2014. Yeah, so, so many years and a lot of sweat. Um, yeah, so it's great. How the race feel as a whole for both of you? Uh, easy. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, to be, to be honest, I think this is the best shift I've been in. So Good timing. Uh, yeah, we had uh, the bell at uh, 7.15, so I was like, we need to run like uh, 69 yep. to get the standard. Because, you know, the Olympic standard window is open already, so I was like, if you're lucky here, we don't, we don't have to chase next year, but, you know, we need to fight another day. We'll get in Budapest. Yeah, yeah. No, it's it definitely not one of the, uh, like, fastest races from the gun. But, uh, you know, like, like I said earlier, like, there's six or seven of us that all can run 59-60 on that last quarter. So it's, like, really about positioning and being in the right spot and trusting your fitness and trusting, um, you know, your decisive moves and when you make them. Great job, guys. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Congratulations. Congratulations.